Okay, so today we're going to do a foot detox. This is Cherie and Kathy is behind her and uh, myself are all, well, Cherie is going to be the administrator here. And these are the foot baths that we're going to be putting our feet into. So I'll be back with you in just a minute. The first thing Cherie had us do is put this bamboo belt on is that correct yes infrared bamboo belt and, and that will open up the area that it is um, around or surrounding and it will help to uh, detoxify more from the body well this is a strap to hook us up to the electronics of the foot bath this also allows us to tell how much we're pulling from the body because if we pull too much from the body it will shut the machine off Oh, so it's a safety measure as well. As well. So, so the, the purpose for the wrist straps is to let us know how much it's drawing from the body. We don't want to draw too much from the body, um, and the machine will shut itself off if it has reached its limit of drawing from the body. So that's the reasons for the wrist straps. And then you said the salt... The salt in the water, um, we put salt in the water to activate the ions that are in the array. And the ions go negative through the body, changes into positive, and then the toxins come out through the bottom of your feet where there are 4,000 pores in the bottom of your feet. Okay. And you could just go ahead and put your feet in there. And then you just get comfy. However comfy you are, if you need that forward or backwards, let me know. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put you guys on a low setting, and the reason is is because I do not want to draw too much out of your body at once because I don't want you to feel sick or ill. Um, and so I have you on the lowest setting, and I also have the lowest arrays that are in here. You guys will be on 30 minutes. Your belts will be on. If they get too hot, let me know, and I will turn them down. I usually turn them on three, so if it's too hot, let me know, because some people are like, whoa. And so your ionization now, you can see, what is happening is the ionizers are working. That's what this white type of foam that's, this is letting us know that the ionizers are working. What we do see sometimes from ionization in itself is the water changing colors. That's a natural chemical reaction that happens with ionization. So we will typically see water that would be orangish color, brownish color, or greenish color, but yet it's clear like a rock candy type of a color. That's what happens when there's no feet in the water. Mm. When we put feet in the water is when we start seeing things floating on the top. So it's not really the color of the water that we're looking at. It's the color and the things that are coming up on the top of the water. Here's a little chart, and I can show you guys here. You can pass that around to both of you. Um, these will signify the different changing colors that we could potentially see as we go through your detox. Um, generally, we don't see really gross, thick water on your first or even your second go around. Um, and typically, we don't see things like um, gallbladder. It's kind of like pulling, um, detoxifying, and drawing things out in layers like an onion. So when we get to the gallbladder, we know that we have gotten to a deep portion of the body and we have toxified from that area. There are times when I've had people come in, they're on a low setting, and it turns the dark greenish color right away. That means that we're pulling toxins from that area that really needed to be worked on. Um, it's rare, but I've had it happen. So these are just the colors that you can potentially see. Um, the thing that we usually see first is yeast and lymphatic um, that starts to pull out from the areas. And the next things that we typically
typically will see is the orangish color coming out. The orangish color is detoxifying from the joints. So um, that's another section that we see. We start seeing next like a brownish type color that's detoxifying from the liver. And we also, after the brown starts coming, we start seeing this yellowy, greenish type color in the middle. Um, that comes before the dark green. And that's detoxifying from female areas, male areas, your kidney, your bladder, your urinary system. So the last thing that we usually see is the heavy mud or the, um, the gallbladder, which is the green. And then we see not typically on the top but heavy metals heavy metals are heavy so they sink to the bottom and when they sink to the bottom we need to you know we'll see that when we start emptying the tubs out is how we see those sometimes we will see them floating on the top a little bit here and there they'll show themselves but they kind of get stuck in the debris that's up there um so those are that's the that's the whole thing here I have yet to see, I've been doing these for eight years, I have yet to see um, red flecks in the water. I have yet to see um, black. I've never seen anybody's water turn completely black, and I've never seen red flecks. Red flecks is blood clot material. I would imagine that if somebody that had been on warfarin or trying to get rid of blood clots and things like that, I'm guessing that we might see something like that. Um, because I've even done women that have been on their menses and I've not seen red flags. So it's something that would be separate type of a detoxification process. Um, the black is detoxifying from the liver, but so is the brown. I'm imagining and just from doing work and doing all of these for so long that when you detoxify from the liver and it's black, we probably should be really working on the it would mean that your liver is so overloaded that we're having this typical color come out because um, I have yet to see it. So, and that's about it for the colors. But it's uh, sometimes it's kind of harder for you to see than it is for um, up there. Because you know what you're looking for. Right? right, and also because of the white color and the lighter colors. So when I'm talking about layers, when we start getting color, like an orange or whatever, you'll start seeing these white ones underneath. They'll turn orange, but you can still kind of tell what they are. Mm -hmm. So if I can show you, you see like this thicker clumps, mm -hmm. the thicker clumps right here, yep. that's yeast. All of the more finer clumps, that is all lymphatic. So that's what we're pulling first. And the most of the ones that are online that I show or I post are either somebody that has came a couple of times, um, but I did show my nieces the other day, and she's 12, and hers was really thick and yucky, and I didn't have her up very far. And this is posted on your website, Natural Essence? Yes, it is. Natural Essence on my website. Or my Facebook page, I'm sorry. So then we can see the colors. You can start seeing the stuff that's floating out and about. There's sometimes you'll feel tingling. Sometimes people feel tingling in the bottom of their feet, or sometimes people will feel tingling in areas that are injured or have been injured or um, that are needing more attention to, I guess I would say. Yeah. And you, you typically can do that. People, I feel that people that are more in tune with their body will feel more. And my younger generation feels it more than my older generation. So, and that's kind of goes along with yeah. telling different, More you know, in tune. Yeah, more in tune. So, in here we can see in yours you have some yeast as well. You don't have too much yeast, but you do have a little bit. Yours is mostly lymphatic, though. If you can see the little, the darker circles that are in here. And those are, the, the other white that is floating around is the lymphatic system.
But as you can see how the water is changing colors, it looks like rock candy, like a clear like rock candy color. So we have a lot of lymphatic in here. Yours is a lot of lymphatic. I was hoping it would mm -hmm. pull some of the lymphatic yep. out. Because I do that self breast massage. Okay. But you can see the flex mm -hmm. laying on the top of the surface there. I also have a lot of moles and I'm, I know that those um, are an indication also of candy or mm -hmm. yeast. Right. Almost can't see my feet now. <laughs> <laughs> Kathy's on the other hand is looking a little crazy. <laughs> so, and all this orange indicates that. But how I was telling you before, if you just want to like concentrate on this area. So do you see the white that's kind of mm -hmm. like a thicker hue that's underneath of it? Mm -hmm. That would be all emphatic. But where we get into the little like thicker chunks right there, that's yeast. But you see how the orange over top of it has kind of magnified mm -hmm. to be able to see it a little bit better. And each time you get this done, I turn the machine up a little bit more and I turn the machine up a little bit more. I also have a different array that I brought with me. And I can show you the differences. What does that word mean, array? Array, this is uh, what is the ionizer. So this is what pulls from the body. And what I put, the only thing that gets put in the water is uh, iodized salt. Because the iodized salt will activate the ions that are in the array. Now we have here, if you, these are the ones that you are on. Um, and you can see there's the coils. So the coils are a, they're metal coils that have the ionization and they're wrapped around here. When we get into a higher array and I start to really pull stuff from the body, I start using this array. Might be a little harder to see, but there's, can you see the silver inside of there? Mm -hmm. That is plates. Those are full plates. So the full plates will draw more from the body. This one here is an eight plate. They have, I've seen them being sold as much as 10 plates. Mm -hmm. So I haven't had to purchase a 10 plate yet for anybody. The eight plates seem to be working fine for people that are. So the more you come, the more we turn the machines up, the more that we, um, you know, get things moving in the body and have you in the right direction uh, with supplementation and things like that for things that you're trying to work on for your body. So mine is starting to detoxify from the joints as well. I'm starting to have that orange color come above. Orange is really nice. And the... Everybody's is different. I mean, typically they can sort of somewhat be the same, but if we can look at yours, and then we can look at hers, they are a lot different. <laughs> So we can see that everything is individualized for everybody and it just doesn't pull stuff out. And you have one minute left. So I'm almost done. And there's a little bit of green no, no tone to it. Some brown, which is signifying uh, detoxification from the liver. There is orange in there, which is also detoxifying from the joints out of the body. And this little bit of yellow greenish. So that means I'm done? That means you are done. Okay. Just keep your feet still. What's Kathy doing here? Kathy pulled out um, some yeast. She did pull out some lymphatic. We do have a little bit of liver in there. We have a little bit of the joints as well, and kidney, gallbladder, um, or I'm sorry, there's no gallbladder. Well, there might be a little, little tiny bit in here, it might be a little darker green. Not enough to be totally noticeable, 
um, but the yellowish greenish in the middle there is from the kidneys, the urinary tract, the uh, female areas. And I definitely had some needs. Can you um, set this or plan it for doing a certain type of detox, or does it just do whatever it does? I can set it to do certain different types. So we can draw, do more negative, or we can do more positive. I can do more targeting to pulling heavy metals. Um, and that's kind of all about it. Then we have a low setting and we have the normal setting. And her ankles were swollen, 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 swollen. And then when she gets this done, it, get, it quits. Hmm. Well, finally, it's the lady that flies. Oh, yeah, well, she's sitting a lot. Mm -hmm. So basically all you did there was just to wipe, rinse off the yes. gunk that I can yes. wipe my feet. Yep, now you can wipe your feet. All right, so this, uh, as my feet are out, and there's some heavy metal chunks that are floating to the surface, and that's that little white speck there that you can see, and one there. So there's a couple of them actually, and there's another one over there. Mm-hmm. There's one that's on the side of the. Yeah. So you can get that one. See it? Yep. Interesting. So if you would like to have a foot to detox spa day, you can contact Cherie Sessions at 517-404-8712.